Wow, just look at this gorgeous view. I have finally arrived at India's first floating hotel, the Polo Floatel, and the view from outside is so gorgeous. I cannot even wait to check in and see what's in store for me ahead. Come. Look at this vintage telephone and the vibrant paintings. Oh my god, I can literally sit here for hours just admiring the artwork. This hotel has managed to amalgamate the old heritage of Kolkata with a modern touch. So I just finished my check-in formalities in the reception area which is on land. But the reason why Polo Floor Hotel is known as India's first floating hotel, you can see that behind me. The actual hotel is located on water, and this bridge that you can see behind me, you have to cross this bridge to reach the hotel. Come. I'm so excited to see my room. I'm staying in one of their heritage cabins and they've told me it has an amazing view. Oh my god, how cute is my room? Just look at the view. Wow, this literally feels like I'm on the deck of a ship. Oh my god, I didn't even realize there's a whole deck out here. It's so gorgeous. It's unbelievable how beautiful the view from this deck is. I can literally see the new Hooghly Bridge on my left and the Howrah Bridge to my right. And it's like bright and sunny in the afternoon. I cannot even wait to see how this view is going to look at sunset. of the property has been so nicely done up with this nautical theme like you see there are maps there are paintings there are these oars i mean you just cannot help but fall in love with this property I've now come to Polo Floater's multi cuisine restaurant, the Bridge Bistro and Bar. Here you can either opt for their very very elaborate buffet spread or you can just order a la carte. I am obviously opting out for the buffet spread because I want to try out a little bit of everything. Looks delicious. Let's dig in. I'm starting with this grilled vegetable salad. Looks super refreshing. And uh, I think I'm going to go for starters next since I'm in Kolkata might as well have some fish fingers. The new Hooghly Bridge on one side, Howrah Bridge on the other. The true meaning of food with a view. A boat ride on the serene waters of the Ganges. I'm going to go ahead and experience this boat ride now. I'm also going to have a little picnic on the boat. So so excited for this. Cannot even tell you.
All set! absolute titanic dream moment here right now this is so romantic although i don't have a man in my life right now this would be so so romantic if i was here with my special someone for those of you who do have a special someone this is the perfect spot to plan a nice date to propose to your partner or for those of you who are planning to get hitched isn't this a beautiful location for a pre-wedding shoot with the golden hour sunlight falling on your face and the serene waters of the ganges okay now i know that this vibe is actually perfect for a couple but you can also come here with your friends or family because they actually allow a group size of 4 to 6 people on the boat at once it's a 1 hour experience and you have to pay rupees 4000 onwards to book it for 1 hour also they provide you with decorations for whatever you're celebrating if it's a birthday or an anniversary and the best part my favorite this picnic basket which is filled with snacks and beverages so you can truly have a picnic on the water If you look to my right it's the beautiful Howrah bridge if you look to my left is the new Hooghly bridge we are at the dead center on the water this is just amazing wow what a feeling i could just sit here for hours just looking at the setting sun After that serene boat ride, I just enjoyed a gorgeous, mesmerizing sunset at Sky Deck rooftop restaurant. And guys, the view here—like I know I've honestly been talking too much about the view, but the view at every hour of the day and from every different angle is just mind-blowing. I cannot get enough of it. Like that golden hour on the boat. was as beautiful as this post sunset orangey glow it's so relaxing so soothing there's a beautiful cold breeze and having a warm cup of coffee the night is still so young and i think this is the most relaxed i've been for a long long time <laughs> 